Welcome to Dance Like a Pro program. What's gonna happen today? So we start with the dancers exercises, then we're gonna do drills, then we're gonna go into small choreography, and then we'll do stretching with a little bit mindset tips. Let's get started. So number one exercise, we're gonna exercise our feet to get our feet stronger. Push from the foot, receive the weight. Push from the feet, receive the weight. Ah, one, are we pushing? Go to the very high position, the landing. Ah, uh, one, at least we have to do it two, three minutes. Ah, uh, one, ah, uh, two, ah, uh, three, ah, uh, four, ah, uh, five, ah, uh, six, ah, uh, seven, ah, eight. The best way if you keep doing with me, just listen to my voice and just do those small details. So push, up, transfer, try to stop here in the middle. Feel your body free and relaxed. And then landing. Pushing, landing, so the feet are working. And keep going. Ah, uh, one, ah, uh, two, ah, uh, three, ah, uh, four, ah, uh, five, ah, uh, six, ah, uh, seven, ah, uh, eight, ah, uh, one, ah, uh, two, ah, uh, three, ah, uh, four. Push from the feet. Seven, I uh, reverse angle. One, ah, uh, two, ah, uh, three, ah, uh, four, ah, uh, five, ah, uh, six, ah, uh, seven, ah, uh, eight. One, ah, uh, two, ah, uh, three, ah, uh, four. Uh, five, uh, six, uh, seven, uh, eight. So exercise number one is your feet is done. Next one, we're gonna work on our hip or hip action. Now put two heels down, heels together, toes apart, soften your knees, and we're gonna work only on the figure eight of the hips with your pockets here. Figure eight, figure eight, because our feet already six reverse angle one, two, three, four, hip, hip, seven, one, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and one. Hip, hip, circle, five. Feel like you, when you do it, you have to be already sweating quite alive right now. If you're using all the internal muscles, figure eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So second exercise is done. That was for hip action. Now exercise number three is for the rib cage. So we're just gonna keep our hips in place and just move our rib cage. Right, left, one, two, three, a little bit more volume in the upper body. Let's try with the music. exercises went really really well let's go into our drills sections so what is it drills drills it's already single move actual steps from your choreography which i prepared for you today so and drills we call it single movement drills where you're gonna repeat the same already dance movement more and more and more many many times let's try it okay so let's do a little bit drill with our arms, so tighten your fingers, arms going up and then down, up, down with the fingers, up, down. Same time, you would like. I would like to ask you to introduce a little bit hip action, figure eight type of movement. Up, so make sure the fingers are really, really tight. Fingers really tight, like you hold egg something, like egg, you hold egg between your middle finger and the thumb 
yeah strong fingers and are a little bit figure eight and we're gonna go with the arms so arms going down first then going to the side then going up go over your head and again boom 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 and boom 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 and boom oh, hips high hip twisting this will be drill number two high hip so we're gonna have a circle on the right hip circle on the left hip twist and remember on the hip twist there is a sense of lift like somebody <gasps> hit you into the tummy again so we starting position this way so you can have a hip hip right left there that's the drill number two let's go hip hip land and make sure this left arm is on the opposite is closing you stopping you not opening you and yes you have a hip 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 twist and pay attention to your front leg so it should be turned out in beautiful 90 degree leg. Let's go. Quick, quick, there. Quick, quick, slow. Quick, quick, slow. Quick, quick, slow. Quick, quick, slow. Quick and quick, slow. Picked up feeling. <gasps> Picked up. So the spine is tilted forward, as always. Reverse angle. Drill number two reverse angle quick quick slow 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 so we have a hip 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 twist hip 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 twist hip 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 twist hip Hip, hip twist. Excellent. That was drill number two. Drill number two. Number two. Okay, drill number three. Drill number It's a side. Okay, drill number three. Side to side cucarachas. So we have a quick, quick, slow with this line. Hip, hip, slow. Hip and hip. Slow. So we're not just doing figure eight. We introduce timing, introduce these beautiful lines. So it's already we're practicing a step, exactly the way it should be. Keep, hip, slow. Keep, hip, slow. Quick, quick, slow. In this position, make sure your one of your hip is dropped, one and slow. So this was drill number three. Let's do drills with the music. doing our amazing dancers exercises and after the drills we're ready to do our choreography it's gonna be four very small simple sections so let's go simple first section so remember how in our drill section we were working on the figure eight 
that's how we're gonna start. So we will start on the right foot, the weight is on the right foot, the left foot is next to the leg, and then we're gonna put two heels down and we'll, we'll do hip actions. But instead of like on the drills, we're doing a classic basic way on the uh, normal level, we'll go uh, down. So you go hip action two, hip action three, and hip action four one, we will stand up and melt into both. So reverse angle. So this is section number one. And two, and thirty, and four one. One more time. So we start with our body weight on the right leg, left, uh, left leg together, very, very tight position between inner thighs. We're going two, thirty, and four one. Now, same time, we're gonna add arm styling. So we'll add those beautiful arms we will be exercising in the previous steps here in this program. So we're going and two, thirty, and stand up, four, one. That's the first section. So one more time. Two, thirty, and four, one. So reverse angle. Very good. Beginning, close legs, tight position, hip actions in place. Two, thirty, and four, one. Remember that we start low, then we have a hip to the left, hip to the right, and when you hip going to the left, you're gonna stand up into the vertical position. Okay, so this was section number one. What will be section number two? So after we did this movement and we stand up, we will do sliding door, back basic. So send our heel back, step back here, a little bit ripple in our middle part, which we'll call replay three, four, one. So we have a delayed forward walk with the bent knee. We call it 90 degree, or that's the whole section called sliding door. So that's section number two. So let's go again from section number one, two, three, stand up, four, one. Then we're going back two and three, four, one. So now when we're going back, Put your heel down as fast as you can. Now keep the front leg where it is. Try not to slide it. And only have a little bit flexibility in the middle part. That's a little bit technical secrets for you. Two and three. On three, open your thigh as much as you can. Punch here for one. That's section number two. So reverse angle. So section number one, hips. Two, three, and four, one. Section number two two and together with your leg you see i'm doing my arm i'm going up and three over the head four one so this is a two sections so last time and two three four one two three four one okay one more time two sections together our choreography so we start section number one hip actions two three four one section number two sliding door two and a three forward okay section number three we're gonna press this leg this 90 degree leg and we're gonna change with the high hip to the side kukaracha two let's do it with the music This is the end of this program and uh, this is our final segment which is a mindset and tips so number one uh, my small advice for you when you learn how to dance the key is 
whatever information you have, you have to try it on your body. So doing drills and exercises is extremely, extremely important. So your body will remember only something it does for many, many, many times correctly. Let's say if you're working on your pendulum in a drill section or we working on collecting the body, collecting the leg under the body with the, this picked up feeling. So we have to do it over and over many times to create a muscle memory. So the drills and exercises is extremely important. So then when you move into choreography, now next segment, uh, you, you already have a skill that you can work on styling. So that's why this program is built in this way, where you start with exercises, you move into drills, which is the most important for you when you do it over and over with my small tips and technical secrets. And then you can do choreography. And the next tip for you, it's a mindset. So whatever you learn, you need to have a strong body, but also a strong mind. So think in the correct way. What is the correct way of thinking? It's always focusing on what to do rather than what not to do. For example, if uh, we give you here in this section, let's say figure eight motion. So all you have to think is how you're going to do figure eight. Don't think about your knees. Don't think, you know, uh, how I'm going to catch balance or I'm off balance or I don't look good doesn't matter just try to think on this specific goal and let's say if we give you a little bit uh, more goals well, let's say here you do figure eight and inner thigh type and arm styling only focus on that and focus on what you are doing so don't try to think oh i'm not looking good or maybe oh i don't have balance so it doesn't matter balance doesn't matter those things most important you get a little bit information and you just focusing put your focus energy and attention to that little information trying to make it work and do it over and over just focus let's say on these three uh, little tasks and it will eventually become the natural part of you